2011, more Americans awaken to the realities of money, power, and politics. I'm going to a fundraiser just like everybody else and with 30 to 40 of my closest friends who are spending the same amount of money, maybe some more. I'm not buying that vote. I was actually thinking of writing a book, uh, The Idiot's Guide to Buying a Congressman. The call to follow the influence of lobbyists and powerful special interests in politics grew louder across the country and the world. Who's I will not bring a bill to the floor uh, that hasn't been posted online for, for at least 72 hours. We're beginning to understand that your, your rules don't live up to what you actually promised. The closed-door meetings have government watchdog groups up in arms. As that sentiment grew, so too did Sunlight. So many of the things that we were working on were things where Sunlight was either the articulator of the idea, the exemplar of the code, the um, builder of the tools, um, or later the agitator for um, delivering on the things that we had promised. This year, we help defend the government systems that make transparency possible with our Save the Data campaign. We mobilized over 10,000 people to help keep crucial programs off the chopping block. As a result of our Read the Bill campaign, Congress passed new rules proposed by Sunlight to allow anyone to read bills before they're considered on the House floor. Our leaders kept up the pressure, testifying before Congress, advocating for transparency and open gov on the Hill. We trained journalists all over the world to use our tools to find the data they need, and then we brought those tools into new communities, empowering them to follow the money on their own. We used this same energy to drive the conversation around lobbying and help inform new legislation on lobbying reform. Our developers started rolling out national data apps to make government data useful to us all. We expanded Influence Explorer to show you how special interests influence policymaking in more areas. Inbox Influence, our new Gmail plugin, instantly shows you the political giving and lobbying history of the people and organizations mentioned in emails you receive. Our flagship conference, Transparency Camp, doubled in size this year, bringing together over 270 activists, journalists, government officials, and others to discuss the future of open government. It's really given me the tools and the energy to go back to the trenches and keep fighting this fight. We worked with transparency activists from overseas on our turf and theirs, journeying to countries like Poland, Lithuania, Brazil, Chile, and Germany to continue the international discussion on open gov. We also expanded our grassroots campaigns at home, forming new coalitions with open gov organizations in states like Utah, where we joined with local groups to demand that the nation's governors support open gov legislation. Meanwhile, our developers continued working with local civic hackers to help build data tools to address government issues, like improved legislative data, and updated tools like our Congress app to make it easier for the rest of us to access real-time information about Congress. We also revamped and rebuilt Capital Words, a tool to compare what members of Congress are talking about over time. In September, Congress announced the creation of the Joint Select Committee on Deficit Reduction. Faced with the threat of such an important decision happening behind closed doors, we embarked full throttle on a campaign, joined by some 40 groups to demand openness from the Super Committee. We blogged, emailed, reported, made headlines, tweeted, organized citizen engagement, pushed for more effective rules on openness, and streamed their open meetings on Sunlight Live. We've been on the cutting edge, and we've gotten a lot of credit for our work. But most importantly, we've made a difference. Sunlight Foundation was able to connect me with staffers and, and activists in other states uh, to talk about their open records law and how they made changes or didn't. I couldn't quantify the, the value of that. And we've had a lot of fun along the way. 2011 was a successful year for Sunlight, thanks to your support. And we can't do this work without you. Please donate now to help us keep shining a light on government.